Getzville, New York, on our Democrats line. Good morning. Go ahead. Morning, Bill. You've got the greatest voice in television, let me tell you. Uh, listen, may I speak uh, uh, openly and directly to Senator Obama, his campaign, and Congress. Is that okay with you? Is what okay with us about Senator Obama? May I? May I? Yes, may I thank, and Congress, too. This it's, is very important. It's, it's open phones. You go right ahead. Okay. Uh, I'm going to be direct. Senator Obama, please tell the nation where you stand on the issue of reparations for the slaves, and I'll tell you why. I've been trying for three months, and I've gotten no response from you, from you. and now if you don't come out publicly and tell the country where you stand, <clears throat> we could be torn apart on this issue. In about seven to ten days, I've got punch cards made up for each and every, every member of Congress, and I'll be taking them down to Washington to personally deliver them. What's on these, pl what's on these pledge cards? Well, I'm, they're pretty direct, and they're quite specific. On these pledge cards, I'm going to be polling each and every member of Congress. Will they support federal tax dollars for slave reparations in any way, shape, or form? And I'm going to ask these Congress people, and, and by the way, uh, I think it's only fair that the people who are running against these congressmen who's up for elect elections and the senators that are up, of course, this year, where their positions stand. Now, that's a lot of, it's a Herculean effort. And uh, would it be okay if I give my name and address uh, to the general public? We generally don't allow that, sir. So if you have an email, you want to email us a website or whatever, we'll, let the, we'll see if we can get that for you. But next we go to Marion 